What up, yo? It's your boy White with Bubble Breads, a.k.a. I slap you, a.k.a. Say it again, you know what I mean? Hey, yo, and this is Big Ma, King from Queens, Bubble Breads, born and, born and raised, about to talk with White about this whole little versus thing that we just found out about, and we need to get right into it, bro. Locks versus motherfucking dips that, bro. So Let's they just, talk, yeah, man. they just put the info out today that the locks is going to be battling dipset and versus because they just did a show i believe in july 3rd or something they did the performance together you know what i'm saying oh, so, yeah yeah they was doing a show together i seen a little footage of it it looked like it was crazy yo i mean i was like damn I bet it was yo i bet Word. it was yo i bet Word. it was so me and white was talking about it a little something earlier and we was trying to get into it on on I didn't do my research, White. Right? I'm still going by head, bro. Like, I'm still going by the head. Shit. You, a queen, you Queens born, raised New York. You don't have to do research to know about the locks and dips, that uh, nigga. No, you, you really don't. But you know how you register in your head, like, their songs? Like, I'm trying to register all the all the songs, yo. You know what? You know what? You the know other what? part about being a fan is if, if you don't, like, we have to do research for the journalist work of what we're doing. But if you're just a fan... When they going back and forth, you be like, "Oh shit, I forgot about that one." You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do something even special for us while we while we on our jump off. I'm pulling up the laptop right now, and putting my glasses on, and I'm freaking going through some songs, man. Because I, because <laughs> you, because you, you was favoring, you kind of favoring Dipset, bro. I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna not, keep it, yo, I'm gonna keep it a hundred. I'm a Locks fan, like hard body, yo. But you I'm be Yonkers, yo. What the yeah, fuck? you're right. But do you know Harlem and is in this all? We all close. The Bronx is close to Yonkers and Harlem, nigga. So oh yeah, yeah, it's all uptown. It's yeah, all so uptown. We, we in the middle, but um. But the thing is, it's like Dipset is just a, a whole nother beast. You know what I'm saying? The locks, you can kind of weigh in with um, Biggie and Puffy and Black Rob and all of them and Craig Mack and all of them. But Dipset kind of held it down on their own. Yeah. 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 I, 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 I understand that and everything. But again, they have, what, three albums maybe? And I understand the other two albums. Their first album is their major album. The other two albums, they kind of, it kind of dwindled off into their own type jump off. Right. So, but um, and real quick, um, the ill part about um versus is not really all about because you only get twenty songs, right? Which is dope. Yes. So I love yes. it because they keep it down to a minimum, and so twenty songs you got to put out your best bangers, and and whoever gets it gets it. Now, as a party or club goer, I used to be heavy in the clubs. You right. know, what I'm if they throw on the locks, we all rocking like okay, New York. But if they throw on a dip set banger, we like oh shit, we going crazy. We turn the tables over. That I mean, right. that's just what it was, right. you know. Right, right. So uh, do this, white. Right? Get on your phone and hit up dip set playlist, yo. For real, hit up dip set playlist, and we going we gonna talk about this, yo. Right, I'm gonna do it right now. What you want, like some kind of um. Yeah, I just googled it. All right, all right. I'm gonna go to um, I'm gonna go to YouTube. Shout out to YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> you staying on YouTube? Playlist. All right. So um, so all right. So let's just talk about it. Like um, let's talk about it. Let's talk about this. It, did it pop up a nice little playlist for you? Yeah, it put a bit that joint. Yeah. All right. So 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 let's go. Let's go. Um. Let's let's let's. You who want to go first? You want to go first? Um, you can go first. No, all right. Let's. I'm. I'm gonna go with it. I'm. A, and I know this is not how they're gonna have this set list. Money, power, and respect, bro. The album number one. And so we're gonna go through. Let's 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 go through. Yeah, money. See, money, power, respect is um. That's gonna be one of their bangers, but you know. That's their bit. first thing. That's the that's the album. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? So, so that's the that's the well, that's the song, of course. But the whole that's their major album off of Bad Boy, is Money, Power, and Respect. So, and the, the song alone, that's 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 pretty big, right? Yeah. That's pretty big. What can you say against that? I mean, shit, you probably can go to the the Dipset Anthem song, yo. The Dipset Anthem, you think that'll match that? You think if if they pull out Money, Power, and Respect? What are they going? Do you think? What, listen, they got, this, listen. Can you hear this? 
Oh. 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 All right, hold on. Cut it, cut it off. All right, that's we, the Dipset Anthem song. We got played on you. Yeah, yeah, because we got played this on YouTube. Yeah, right, yeah, but yeah. that's the Dipset Anthem song. So if they play that, they could, that is, I'm thinking that's taking money, power, respect out because money, power, respect, it just hit different levels. But when the Dipset came on, I don't give a fuck if they was from Harlem. It was just New York ties. That's true. You know what I'm saying? It was just new. Every borough, I think if you was just from New York, when 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 a dipset banger came on, you was like, fuck it. You know, they swag. You know what I'm saying? They come on, they they changed everything. They swag, they music, all that shit combined together. Yeah. Which yeah. made it, you know what I'm saying? We never looked at yeah. dipset like they the toughest niggas in the world, but we look at it like yo, they make some of the hardest music. Like I no, said, they were they 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 rep they rep Harlem as them slick dudes, the the slick Harlem hard niggas. Like they 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 did it right. You know what I mean? I ain't gonna say you know they ain't come out like no softies and and they 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 came out hard. They just came out as fly Harlem dudes. That's that's pretty much what it is. But yeah. I'm looking at I'm looking at money, power, respect right now, right? So they got like we just said, money, power, respect. You know, they got 24 hours to live. Right. Mm. And 20, I love all of it, yo. Like, I, I can't even go, I, I'm not even going to go track for track right now because um, it, it's just too much. If you go through Dipset, you would have to go through Dipset catalog too. Like, you just yeah, shout out like some a, of the, yeah. Dipset catalog is crazy, yo. It is, it is, and they got the mixtape stuff too. So it's, that's what I'm trying to tell you, to, yo, man. It's what? gonna be, a, this is gonna be a crazy one, y'all. And you know what? Because Dipset kind of held New York down. It was almost when the locks was dying down, almost. You know? <laughs> so, oh no, it's, it's. I think, and and I'm. We might be wrong, but it probably was the transition from Bad Boy when it got slow. Right. When they won, when they wanted to drop a, a fridge on, on Puffy's head. This like, is why it was so right. ill because you you right. The locks was doing that shiny suit shit. And then when they left, they got a little more the gutter. Cat. They got more cat. gutter. Yeah. Right, so, so here's the question. Did did Dipset drop in between that or we gotta do more research though. I just remember I was rocking with the I wasn't rocking with the locks and dipset at the same time. I just oh, remember when I was rocking with the you locks. You're absolutely part. right. You absolutely right. Nah, he wasn't. God, nah, because I think after Biggie died and you know Black Rob was trying to hold down Bad Boy, I think that's when the locks and was trying to depart from Puffy from all that other shit, and then Dipset and, just filled yeah. the void because Mace was on. Mama Mace was on a run. Remember they was having all that back and forth feud with him. Right, 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 right. <laughs> it was running to Atlanta and to the um. Fucking church. I mean, no, I don't mean to say like. <laughs> Damn, why? Come on, man. We blasting this all over. The <laughs> when he was going to church and doing all that stuff, but that's when um, you know, Dipset was all over the radio, and it was just, and, you know, Cam and Jim Jones and them was letting it have him, let him have it, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see that. I can see that. I can totally see that. Yeah, I think that's what it was too, because they, because you're right. The the because Jay Z didn't really blow up until. After Biggie, you know, the Biggie situation, his his experience got a lot better. And when it did, when it did get better, you know, Cameron them was doing mixtapes and then they landed with Dame over at Rockefeller. So when they landed with Dame over at Rockefeller, yeah, I don't think the locks was, I don't think the locks were out there like that. Well, I gotta go back and do some more research on it, but um, I know when um, Dipset came on the scene, I think they was fucking with um, they were they were fucking with um, Jay Z and them, but then them niggas they they did so much shit where their name got so big, and that's when that's how um Cam became like they they became big so because they was hustling so hard on the streets, right. And right, Dipset became right. a household name, and that's when Damon Dash wanted to fuck with them more. Like, oh, I. Right. Yeah, that's what he did. That's when he pulled them over to Rockefeller. Because I remember yeah. him saying something like that on Drink Chan, um, Cameron. Yeah. He was like, you know, that he was, they was just making so much noise that that's when Dame was like, I, right. you know, yeah. they were yeah, there's the, you know them and G Unit made so much freaking mixtape noise. You know what I mean? As 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 who they were, they were making so much mixtape noise that when. 
they they bought that noise with them to to a you know to a record label. But yeah, but and, you know, um, not to cut you off, but real quick, you know what I'm saying? As we talk about it, the for hip hop, yo, these dudes is going to Madison Square Garden, yo, in New York City. It's about to go down. We might have to make that trip, yo. Yeah, we might have to. We gotta figure out a way to make it make that trip. Madison Square Garden, yo, dude, man, it's gonna be so lit. And you know, people go outside now. It ain't like oh, before. <laughs> nah, nah, they're gonna, they gonna, they gonna be unmasked up in there and just. It's gonna look like. Hey, I ain't going gonna... because I, I guarantee half them niggas ain't vaccinated. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, white. <Mike>. So... <laughs> Big shout out to New York. New York was doing it right the whole time. It's Atlanta, well, you know, it. Atlanta been doing it wrong, but shit. <laughs> Atlanta is having some issues, but I don't know. I don't. Uh, uh, now, now you got me thinking, bro. Now you. Got hey, who me you thinking. got though? I said I got Dipset. This is white, you know. I got Dipset. Who you got more? Oh, shit. I'm because uh, here's the deal. Okay. I mean, just as a hip hop head, you ain't got to do all the, the journalist work right now. You're just going off of our if recollection, you were, okay. your recollection of what you listen to. There, if I did it blindly, like just like yo, if you just came to me, I'd have been. I say Dipset, like Dipset will come out of me, like oh no, Dipset got him all day. But okay. but when you start thinking about like okay, let's start going into Locks archives. I, I'm a, I'm, I'll put it to you like this. Fabulous is ridiculous, but Jadakiss is re real. Yo, he's come on, he's on another level. So when you put they they hit they they verses together, it seemed like Jadakiss he put him to sleep early. Yo, it, 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 he put him to sleep like in round seven. They ain't had to go to round twenty. Twenty. So, so I, that's what I'm trying to thank you. That's what I'm trying to say. Locks, they gonna bring their shit, but. If they bring out 20 songs, Dipset might be able to just overpower them with their bangers, yo. That's and, and and that's that's the see, and that's the now you're going back to the conversation we had about Bow Wow and 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 and, and Soldier Boy. Yeah, but Soldier Boy, but Soldier Boy didn't fuck he Soldier Boy did it for entertainment purposes. He played the same song three times, yo. Yo, I, that was one of the funniest shows I ever seen in my I loved it, yo. <laughs> I love it. I love it. But my, my point is your point about Dipset. Like you're you're absolutely right. Like Dipset, Dipset, even when they was with Rockefeller, didn't have Rockefeller all over their album. No, they didn't you know on I mean? yo, they did this is the ill part about Dipset. If you think about they didn't really use no other brand, yo. They didn't use Jay-Z or no, Dick and Dash. They, they didn't even, brand. yo, first off, they didn't even, it wasn't even like Cameron and Dipset. No, it was Dipset, yo. Oh, <laughs> it wasn't yo. like somebody had a lead in it. They just came out and they all were smashing. Even the same thing with the locks. The locks, you know what I'm saying? They all, everybody in the locks is crazy. You got the ghost, you got Sheik Looch, and then you got Jada Kiss. All of them are right. crazy, yo. Individually and as a group, yo. They, 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 I mean, I'm a locks head, yo. I yeah, just now, when yeah, it comes yeah. to partying, I'm talking about like I'm I, I like I'm a party type of dude. So if I go to the club, if I throw in tracks, I could probably ride to the locks longer than dipset because dipset is just a certain type of energy. But if you want a club in a party environment, dipset oh, oh, it's, it's dip all day. And that's what I meant by like if you came to me, that's what I meant. Like if you came to me and asked me the question straight up, I'm gonna say dipset. Only because of the partying vibe and all that other stuff, you're absolutely right. But if you want to say like who's like 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 because don't forget they got you know, but they but you not it, it's dipset. Let me stop. I'm not even going anymore, bro. Like I'm, I, I, <laughs> yeah. I can't even I can't even deny it anymore because you're right, bro. Like the whole vibe is just ridiculous, bro. Like it's just re, it's just re. It's now just let me ridiculous. ask you a question now. Now when they do this group joint, they're not gonna be able to do individual songs like Jada ain't gonna have to put. I don't them. know. I don't know. And that's why I was asking earlier with you, y'all. Like, like if they, they go did, put Jada against Cameron. If they did do that, you know what I'm saying? You got Jim Jones out there, nigga. I mean, you got, Jones, you got you got Cameron. That's what I'm trying. You got no, but Jim Jones got some bangers, yo. So you got Jim Jones and Cameron. No, you got the ghost. Jules had an album too. And Juice, I ain't even get to Jules yet, nigga. You know what I'm saying? But this is what I'm trying to tell you. So then you go to the locks. 
You got the ghost. You know what I'm saying? Styles P, he it did the thing. Ghost. It stops at ghost. I love Sheik. I think Sheik is one of the best dudes, yo. But Sheik. it stops at ghost. Right. It stops Sheik. at ghost. I don't think Sheik could hold it down Dolo. No. And the ghost had hard. I mean, he held it down, but he wasn't like, he wasn't no... I'm looking for his, and you had to be a real under like hip hop head, like to be like, I'm really looking for Ghost album, yo. Yeah, I'm yeah, serious. Yeah. I'm not trying to shit him because Ghost well, is a legend. Ghost, not Ghost, not no, not really. Ghost out, Ghost had a number one hit. Um, I get high, like like. I, like that's high. what I'm trying to tell you. Ghost was hot, yo. But he when it came to like, Dipset, you know what I'm saying? You got Jim Jones. If if you putting Jim Jones up against Ghost, I gotta I, go with Jim Jones. I, I gotta go with Jones all the way up to today. Yeah. I got to go with Jim Jones. And you're right. And that's the advantage. Like, like Cameron can't beat Jada. That's not happening. You know what I mean? I, and, and, and we can go Cameron all the way when he was with Biggie's homeboy. You know what I mean? Spitting. You know what I mean? Like, early, early. But well, Jim, I think Jim, um, I think um, Joe Santana, um, he didn't manage his career right because he could have been bigger than both of the Cam and Jim Jones. If he would have had somebody manage him right, that's the difference. They all had some ill individual, like like I'm talking about shining stars quality, yo. Yo, question though, question. Do you uh um Jules Santana and Sheik? Nah, Jules kills since I mean Jules Jules, kills um, him. He'll kill. He'll kill sheep. Man, I'm like, yo, I, it's hard to. We, we just debating right now. You know what I'm saying? We speculating, yeah. and it's our, yeah, yeah, it's our um perspectives, yo. So, but I think Jews would kill sheep. You know, and that's I. That's I mean, I think that's a fact, actually. But I don't know. I don't. I, I. I know. You know, with us being out here, be, traveling back and forth, the radios get a little different. The mixtapes on the street is a little different on who popping stuff in the radio. Or popping stuff in their cars. So, you know, people, when I go back to New York, when we go back to New York, the locks is really respected and bumping in cars when we, especially with um, D Block and all that, was bumping in cars. No, when but here's what I know. At the time when both of them was really doing their thing, I was right. heavily back and forth from New York to Georgia. You know what I'm saying? Right. But kind of, I was in the middle of going to the clubs in New York and, you know, of course, in the clubs in Atlanta. And right. you know, the clubs all pretty much play the same thing, is what you know. Right. But right. I ain't really talking about the radio because the radio was just doing it. For, you know, they, it's not a, it's different. Let's not talk radio. No, let's talk yeah. cars and clubs. Yeah, it's let's not radio. Yeah. So as far as cars and clubs, they were bumping the locks, and they bump. Like I said, the locks got bumped in clubs all the time, but it just was a different vibe. It was like, yo, we we mobbing up when the locks come on, but we going crazy when Dipset come on, yo. Oh no, you're right. No, you're absolutely. You're absolutely right. Kind of like, it's kind of like how Nori, like, that's why I think Nori would kill Beanie Siegel because Nori's the same way. If you put Beanie Siegel versus Noriega, I think Noriega's going to do the same shit. He's just going to smack him with all them bangers and the shit that you, that's going to bring back real memories for you. Like, oh, I remember we was in the club and, you know, I can't, I don't have stories like that with the, with the locks. With this, I'm like, yeah, I remember uh, in the club and we was mopping up. Yeah, yeah. You throwing see, bottles see. up in the air and shit. I, I it's just bring yeah, back yeah. memories, nigga. See, now you you fucking with my head now. Now I'm totally dead set. Damn, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> no respect to Lots, because you know Lots and love you, man. Yo, this shit is so crazy right now. To be, you know, this is an ill part about verses, yo. It brings up real conversation because they really gonna go bang head to head. Like we always had conversations, but we never really digged into. Yo, who you think will win? You know what I'm saying? It was always like, yeah, it's never gonna happen. You know, like, but the way they doing it now, I think it's iconic, yo, because I'm loving it, yo. It the, the, the the matches are getting better. Yeah. Because like me and you was just talking about Bobby and um and Keith Sweat the other night, and as I was talking to um my wife about it, I I had to explain to her like 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 yeah, Keith Sweat in our world, and don't forget. He he was on he was chart topping, he was chart topping on the pop charts. Yeah. But Bobby owned the pop charts and the R and B charts. Right. And it's it, it's kind of like a Drake move right now. You know what I mean? Like he owned both of them. Like so that means 
white people and our black people was bumping them at the And then Bobby stage. was throwing on all the new edition shit, yo. <laughs> like, yeah, I know, man. And I think I think if Bob, I think Bobby would have just killed him with Don't Be Cruel, the album alone, because he had seven songs that damn man made number one. You sound like Noriega saying that on um, being Seeker won't get past war report. Oh shit. <laughs> Yo, yo, I'm not going back. Big shout out to my man Beanie Siegel, man. Like, yo, yo and see, and see, you saw that little uh, Instagram Siegel said, man, they want me to come back out. You saw that? <laughs> he had a uh, I ain't see it, but you know, he, he gonna yeah, have to. Man. Only that he gonna have to Millie Vanilli this shit. I don't want to hear the nigga. Yeah. I don't want to hear his voice now. Fuck that nigga voice, uh, man. No, no, he no, better, hey, man. He hey, better, man. he better put on some braids and Millie Vanilli that shit, girl. You know it. <laughs> he can. I mean, shit, we'll respect it because we love the songs and we don't Yeah, because like he, I think he would kill the songs if he started rapping with his. I mean, no, no, he been he's fucked up. I mean, as far as rapping, it, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. His voice is his voice was. Oh man, I felt bad with him even talking. Yo. Yeah, I don't even want to hear that nigga to tell you the truth, man. I know because like, it, it made yeah because that's the bully, man. It just makes you feel hey. like ah. Oh. Every time I hear him talk, I just think about the dude that got dropped that one time when that big nigga punched him in the face. Oh. See, you trying to start some seats. Nah, man, nah. There you, <laughs> there you go, man. Now, nah, honestly, when I see him, I think of uh, DOC from... from. Um, oh, yes, right, from um, Run DMC. From, um, no, 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 DOC from, from NWA, yo. Oh, all right. I'm the diggity diggity doc, y'all. Like, he was the... He had one of the best albums out of the NWA crew. And, and he, then he got to that car accident and he messed his voice, he messed his voice up. Yeah. You know what I mean? And he was one of the dopest lyricists in the crew. Like, like, and, and that's the same thing with Beanie, man. Like, you don't want to hear him no more. Yo, Beanie, like, I don't know, like to be a rapper know. and then lose your voice and shit, you know. I know. But 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 if you listen closely to a couple of verses, they be using that uh they they be getting quiet and letting their song play, yo. <laughs> Just be talking around it. Oh yeah, when well, you, you know yeah, I mean, I mean shit. But Bobby, you know, Bobby was doing that unless you know? was unless you young like Bow Wow. That nigga was jumping all up to, all over the place. <laughs> Bow Wow, the, the energy of an old LL Cool J going back. Nigga, I, nigga looked like a grown like I got a human sized bobble head. He looked like one of them <laughs> shit, yo. <laughs> nigga said, "Y'all know what this is." <laughs> I'm sorry, I still disagree with you with that one. I can't. Bow Wow took that nigga, man. No, man. You know what? You know what happened with Bow Wow when he put on Flirt. When he put on Flirt, I was like, "Here we go." Nah, nah, dead that. I'm a flirt. That's all. That's all petty, on Kelly, bro. Like, really? Yeah, 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 all, yeah. Nah, man. Uh, oh, no, it was my song first. We don't care what was happening in the studio and what went down with you in the record label. That R. Kelly put the damn song out. It's R. Kelly. That's all we know. It was my song first. That's how I'm on it. Nah, bro. Nah, man. It was too many remixes and jump ons. He had he had to pull out. You know, Jermaine Dupri had a bigger album on than 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 Bow Wow. Yo, I, was like, I can't remember the name of Bow Wow's album, bro. I know. Like, I, can't I, know. I don't know, man. I just I don't know. I, I just I, it was a good show. I think they they some good ass entertaining ass niggas, yo. It was a great show. It was, it was the great. shows was are great. getting so much better, yo. Yeah, the shows yeah. are getting better. Yeah, they are. So, so but we're gonna have to we about to wrap this up too because we, we yeah yeah yeah. But one more question, hold on, before we wrap it up, since since I'm feeling this dip set and I'm and I and I'm pulling back off the locks. Do you think it should have just been locks and probably G unit? G unit can't fuck with the locks, nigga. That's come on, man. No, not even with the mixtapes. I would say G unit versus MOP, yo. Nah, do we what? Like, where are you going with that? You don't think like, MLP is good enough to hold this? To, as many... Bro, I, I rolled with you when that mixtape was out. Hell no, yo. <laughs> no. Hell no. MLP? MLP. Them niggas are going to play Annie up three times like your boy <laughs> played his shit, nigga. <laughs> that nigga said M O freaking P. You just got me with that one, yo. Well, what about what about um um fucking um Mob Deep versus um fifty of them people? G unit, nah, I yeah. think Mob Deep would kill him. 
I don't think a lot of people fuck. Uh, now, now, Mob Deep versus Dipset on a lot. That that would be hot too. Yeah, yeah, and I, and then you suggested that earlier. You was like maybe Mob Deep and Locks because it's so it's so hard. Mob Deep, you The thing is, Mob like, Deep was hard too, but they crossed over, yo. Like they kind of crossed did, over to that lane. <laughs> no, like, they did. No, yeah. you, no, you're absolutely right. But at the same time, they didn't have as many hits as Dipset in the club. They had a lot of hits. Yeah, a but not as Dipset. No, that's what, what, that's what you and then you know, now it got me thinking, you know, real quick too. This shit got me thinking when you talk about who's the hottest rap group ever in hip hop, like who's your number one hottest rap group, yo? My hottest, you can't go by me, I'm older, so yeah, you, you, could, you could still drop you. What you gonna say, run DMC? Yeah, run, yeah, yeah. What you mean, fuck? Yo, yo, you, you, you go, what? You know, I rock with, I rock with run DMC, nigga, but come on, man. I, I mean. I was really, I, I was, I wasn't really in the Run DMC era, yo. I was leaving the motherfuckers because, nah, man, that wasn't my era, yo. <laughs> nah. I mean, I, I was around, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm old enough to. I was yeah, fucking I'm, with them, I'm, but it was, I'm Run DMC, EPMD, but you, you know, know my I mean, yo, I'm from my era too, though. But what I'm talking about now is like, what you gonna ride around listening to, nigga? Run DMC or Dipset, nigga. <laughs> first thing, first thing. Let's let's so so let's get this out in the air. This is more borrow bread from Queens, and I'm gonna let you know my favorite rap group ever. Shut your mouth is De La Soul. That's my. That's, I don't care. Hold it down. That sounds good. Whatever, whatever. You got you got them boys coming out of Atlanta too. Don't forget about Outkast, nigga. You got some Outkast. If if you want to say Outkast, that's not even an argument. Right. No, because I seen some. I seen some. Where, um, Outcast was calling out Tribe Called Quest for verses or some shit. They were calling out Tribe Called Quest. For something I seen. I seen something like that, and I was like, "Whoa, that would be kind of crazy, yo." Hmm. Tribe Called Quest, but I don't think Tribe Called Quest can touch them. They and they can fuck Queens. with Outcast. Now I'm from Queens, nigga. Like like. No, nah, they can't. Yes. But no, nah, they can't. If Outcast went on, Outcast is crushing them, y'all. I don't know. The only one, the only ones that can mess with Outcast is Run DMC, and I hate this. Just use two generations. <laughs> you think I think the generation gap is too much, though, man. I don't want to be hearing no old school and then like old school like that. Old school, you know what I'm saying? Like going up against somebody. Too far of a gap. You think that's too far of a gap? Fuck yeah! That's why when Bobby Brown was going up against Keith Sweat, he's like, "Nigga, you going?" Someone I wasn't even thinking about music playing. Yeah, that he he, he couldn't stand that shit. Play. He's like, nigga, I wasn't even in the studio or nothing. Other, I was fucking. He was a kid, and he older. Yeah. I think is he old? I think. Yo, yeah, yo, shout out to Bobby Brown. You see how he said that? He's like, hold on, you want to be in a group? Ain't you like ten years older? Than right, <laughs> right. Uh, but you know, Keith Sweat looked better than Bobby Brown though. Hey. I was like, damn, this nigga still look kind of young. I mean, well, no. First thing, Keith Sweat always looked old since I was a kid. That, like, he, he, yo, it's some, it's, some, it's some Benjamin Button shit going on, yo. Yo, but he got that same look though. That's the illness part, yo. I mean, shit. exactly the same, bro. Exactly the same. But yo, just to go through a couple of verses, man. We liked um, we like the Swizz and um, we like the Swizz and Timberland one. We thought that was dope. White, you picked. You picked Timberland on that, right? I did too. Yeah, hell yeah, yo. Yeah, I, I, I we don't have to. We gonna, we gonna do our top um five um yeah, bad yeah, verses. Yeah, we gotta do our top five. Yeah, but I, I picked Timberland for a, a, a reason. Like Timberland catalog was deeper. Like it seemed like Swiss kept going into the bag with the um his regular shit. Like he went into some really normal shit. Like he yeah. put on an Eve song. He put on like like songs like that. Like yo, he, we all fuck. It's hip hop. But when it yeah. comes to like. Nigga Timberland was doing Justin Timberlake going and and, and yeah. like man, yeah, I, yeah, what, yeah. what is this? I'm like, what is this, nigga? That was fucking hits. It was hits. It was hits. It was hits. You oh talking about what is it? Cross, and crossover he hits, though. It's not like it just stood in. It wasn't just white people. It was all kind of people rocking that oh, shit. Bro, don't forget, not just Justin Timberlake, but for insane, he did gone. Go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Girl, he did gone. One so of the I mean, biggest yeah. songs. And then you got all them hits with Missy and 
I mean, he just he had two, and he did so much shit that I didn't even know. I was like, damn, that yeah. was Timberland. I'm thinking it was a Swiss beast or a fucking nah, nah. He had two Dog and somebody. I, he he had he got those tracks like that too, though. Yeah, now Swiss can Swiss can hang with Kanye, but he can't hang with Tim. No, like no man, yeah. nah, nah, nah. 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 He should have. Nah, Dr. Dre. That would be the double monster. No, I, they Dr. both bow. They, they both bow down to Dr. They said they didn't want to. They can't battle him. Nah, they can't. Uh, like, they really can't. I think Timberland should battle. I mean, or Swiss should battle him, um, even though he wouldn't do it for real, you know. Oh uh, yeah, I, th- I guess for real. I guess no, 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 no. He can't battle for real. No, for real, for real. Wingspan is too big too. For real, should have battled Tim. Nah, for real, wouldn't be in a yeah. with Tim. For real, should have battled Tim, yo, because he's another one that had a bunch of Timberlake songs. And he got more songs on Jay Z than everybody. Like, like, yeah, yeah, he, yeah. He got his wingspan is crazy, yo. Yeah, but yo, his we about to, span. but we about to wrap this up though. Anyway, yeah, nigga. let's wrap it up because we go all night with this. Shit, right. yo. yo, but, but this speaking is- of, yo, yo, speaking of Swizz, um, we are in the works of of bringing Jaron Benton, sitting down with Jaron Benton, and 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 I am going to bring up the topic that he was in school with, out here in Atlanta with Swizz. Oh, he was in the he was in the school. Akon, Akon's brother Boo, and a couple of other people that that that's known. We're gonna have that conversation with him, yo. Yeah, he was he was in the all within the same school, yo. That's Real crazy, talk. yo. I can't wait yeah. to do that because Jaron, he another class. He got so many hits. I, I always try was putting people on the Jaron. Yeah, yeah. You know what saying? a big interview for us in August, and I want people to uh, notice that man. And um, we got a lot more. We got a lot more to talk about too. No, stay tuned, time. like and subscribe yeah. because yo, we about oh, to start right. putting the videos out. It's about to be crazy. Bubble yeah. breads, yo, you gonna see us yeah. everywhere. You gonna be like, man, who the fuck is these bubble bread niggas, man? You gonna find <laughs> out, bro. But yo, yeah. this is your man yeah. White. I'm signing out. You know what I mean? Yo, yo, and this is Big Mar, Big King from Queens, and uh, we want to say, yo, good looking out for y'all. Just support and uh, like and subscribe, please. Like and subscribe. I know it's a little bit of videos up there right now, but y'all about to see everything dropping, and we appreciate all the love. Great. All right, White. All right, yeah. All right, one. All right I'm going to holler at y'all. One. one.